A good smartwatch is supposed to be sturdy, so it lasts years of use on your wrist, and it also needs to look good. The Agptech LW31. It's a really good smartwatch that won't break the bank. So stay with me, and I will show you everything about it. Welcome back, Adam from Family Pop TV. The LW31 smartwatch has a beautiful shiny finish, giving the smartwatch an elegant look. The rectangle body of the watch is made out of zinc alloy and it's got a massive display with anti-fingerprint coating with a beautiful curved 2.5D glass. Inside the packaging we can find the watch itself, a USB magnetic charging cable, the silicone strap and a manual leaflet. The strap comes unattached and I will show you on how to attach it to the watch at the end of this video. The display screen is a color 1.69 inch TFT LCD touch screen display with 240 by 280 pixel resolution. The display provides a clear visual experience as it has vivid bright colors that make it easy to read. It has five steps of brightness and my wife during tests been using the fifth one as it's bright and vivid enough and is better visible in a bright sunlight. Besides, the display lights up automatically as you move your wrist up. The bottom of the watch is made out of plastic material. Here we got a 3-axis G sensor. Here are the magnetic charging pins where you can plug the charging cable. There is one button on the right side of the case. Overall, the LW31 is a bit bulky, however it looks very premium. The LW31 is available in two color options, which are rose gold and black. I have checked the customer's reviews on Amazon, just to find out what other users thinking about LW31. And here we got, works perfect, I love it, or well made, or ich liebe das Design, which is, I love the design, or the battery life is amazing. There are many more feedbacks. In today's review, we will put the Actec LW31 into several tests just to find out if it's really that good. The LW31 is having an IP68 waterproof rating, so I guess I shouldn't be worried about getting it wet while washing hands or taking bath or even swim. We performed a simple waterproof test to verify the water resistant capability of our units. Yes, you want to be very, very sure before you're taking the watch to the pool. The IP68 enclosure of our tested unit should guarantee protection in water up to 1.5 meter deep for at least 30 minutes. The manufacturer doesn't recommend operating the side button while the watch is being submerged and definitely not to use the watch in sauna. And this rule applies to all wearables, regardless their brand or price range, as no watch can withstand the hot steam, as the micro particles of steam can penetrate the seals of the watch. Steam goes in, but obviously can't get out. The IP68 also means that our watch is resistant to dust. The Actec LW31 uses OnWear companion app that you install on your phone, which is where you set and control most of the functionality you'll have to scan a QR code with your smartphone to get to the Apple Store or Google Play. The app is compatible with both iOS and Android. Here in the app you will get some nice graphs of your activities, set the alarms, set your goals, notification, etc, etc. And it gives you control on everything the LW has to offer. It has an overall nice layout and the items are arranged in a logical way. You're not hunting around for a mislabeled feature. All the stats can be shared between other apps, for example, Apple Health in your iPhone. Right, let's get through the watch menu. The first widget when you swipe the display to the left is a step counter or pedometer if you like. Distance and calories burned, organized on one screen. I like it as it gives a clear and visible readings without the necessity to go through the menu. My wife during the trials counted 1000 steps with a manual tally counter and the LW31 counted 996 steps which gives us a pretty decent 99.6% accuracy. Wow! I would recommend to enter the personal data to the app profile like your height, weight and age as it improves the measurements and the stats accuracy. 
The next widget is a heart rate measurement. The LW31 is pretty accurate in monitoring the heart rate. We have compared the heart rate readings from our LW31 with a NHS approved medical pulse oximeter, which has got a high accuracy of heart rate measurements as well as both oxygen saturation levels. The LW31 performs pretty good. The heart rate is pretty accurate. When doing any exercises, the heart rate measurement fluctuates a little and it seems that the watch losing its accuracy a bit. Let's not forget, this is not a medical device, so the readings are supposed to be used just for the reference. Here's my graphic comparison. I'm using here my statistical tool, which is a Minitab. The SPO2 tracking, also known as an oxygen saturation, which is a measure of the amount of oxygen carrying hemoglobin in the blood relative to the amount of hemoglobin not carrying oxygen. The body needs there to be a certain level of oxygen in the blood or it will not function efficiently. Again, we have done some comparability tests with the pulse oximeter and also in this case the LW31 does a pretty good job. The next widget, when you swipe further to the left, is a sleep tracker, which can provide a comprehensive analysis of your sleep, whether you are in deep sleep, light sleep or wake up time. My wife has been wearing a watch for over a week to test this feature and the results are satisfactory. Now, if you swipe down, we get access to the shortcuts, which are Do Not Disturb mode, called here DND. Pressing it will mute all the incoming messages and notifications. Now, if we swipe to the right on the display, we got here the access to all features the LW31 has to offer, represented by nice looking icons. This is just another way to access all the features in the watch. The sports tracking. LW31 has 11 sports modes to monitor your workouts and exercises accordingly. And we got here walking, running, cycling, climbing, basketball, swimming, yoga, elliptical, badminton, cricket and free training which also may be used to track weightlifting exercises. It shows a heart rate, calories burned and counts the length of the workouts. You can easily keep track of these exercises in real time directly on the watch and it allows you to understand your physical condition. Unfortunately, the LW31 hasn't got a GPS on board so you can't track your position during workouts. Watch settings, where you could find language selection and display options, which are a watch faces selection. You can pick and download a selection of available watch faces through the companion app. It's being sent to the watch almost instantly. You can also create your own customized watch face using any photo or image from your smartphone as a background. Scale it and crop it, and here you go. Now, this is an example of a custom watch face. The screen up time, which sets up the amount of time the display lights up after you press the home button. It's a range from 5 to 25 seconds. Race to wake. The screen can briefly lit up for 2 to 6 seconds, and this can be adjusted right here. Find phone feature. The watch has to be connected with your phone, and the app has to run in the background to effectively use this feature and the battery saving mode. The LW31 has a 260mAh battery which lasts around 7 to 10 days of normal use. The battery saving mode turns off the Bluetooth and dims the brightness of the screen to the very minimum to preserve the battery life. This way you could extend the battery life up to one month on a single charge. The battery charging time is around 2 hours. If you would indicate during the companion app onboarding process that you are female, you can use the menstrual cycle tracking feature to log details about your cycle. Using information you've logged, the cycle tracking can alert you when it predicts that your next ovulation period or fertile window is about to start. In the companion app, you got a graphic representation of this feature and it also tracks a pregnancy time. Obviously, these features are turned off if you indicated that you are a man. The music app control. You can control your music app in your smartphone once the devices are connected. Skip to the next song or a previous song. My missus don't use this feature, but I'm sure some of you will find it useful. 
the weather info. This pushes the weather info from your phone. To use this function, the watch has to be connected with your phone. When we scroll down, there are a few more icons for another useful features. Alarm clock, stopwatch and timer. Real-time message notifications, which pushes the notifications about incoming text messages and social apps messages, as well as notifications about an incoming calls. You can easily receive SMS as well as notifications in your Facebook, Instagram, WhatsApp, LinkedIn, Skype, Twitter, etc. etc. There are two features which are very useful. The activity reminder, when you'd spend too much time sitting by the desk. And drink reminder, as often some people forget to hydrate themselves throughout the day. This has to be set up within the app. The strap is made out of silicon and has a stainless buckle. The strap could be replaced for any 20mm wide strap of your choice. For example, silicone, leather or metal strap, as long as it's 20mm wide, measured between the lugs. I'll show you how to replace the straps. Pull this little pin here, clicked. Pull the pin, it clicked and you're good to go. Very simple and straightforward. As you can see, this is a simple and definitely good looking device. It fills the bill quite nicely and it's fashionable and has a stylish design. You won't be disappointed with your purchase. It's got all the basics you'll need to track your fitness goals. If you're thinking about buying this one, there's an Amazon link in the video description when you could find it for the fair price. Guys, that's it for today. I hope you enjoyed today's video and found it pretty informative. Please show us some love. And if you are new to the channel, please consider subscribing to Family Pop TV.